This week at Shetland Pony Club, we've been having lots of fun letting the ponies out into their new paddock. As you can see, they can't wait to get out and to tuck into the grass. Tintin, Snowdrop and Simba, our new ponies, are settling in really well and are joining in with the rest of the herd in the new field. One of the reasons that we've been letting the Shetlands into this new field is that they're very good at eating down all the bushes and brambles and stinging nettles. You can see here Simba's having a good go at eating this sapling. The Shetlands have really tough mouths so it doesn't hurt them if they eat thorns or stinging nettles. In fact, they think it's rather delicious and love it. Whilst the Shetlands are enjoying their juicy grass, Lucy and Amy have come up with a fun, tasty, crafty pony for you to enjoy at home. We hope you enjoy it and we can't wait to see your creations. It's Lucy and Amy. We love Shetland ponies and making crafts. This week we will be decorating pony biscuits. You will need chocolate buttons, I'm using milk chocolate and white chocolate, a knife, biscuits, you want to look for biscuits that are rectangular but if you can't find any you can always cut them down to shape. You will also need icing, you can get these from most supermarkets. You'll need coloured icing and make sure you have a dark one too. The last thing you will need is edible eyes. I found these ones at my local supermarket but you can also buy them online. If you can't find them you can always use a white chocolate chip and decorate with dark icing. Step one is to stick your chocolate button onto your biscuit using icing. Next you'll want to use your dark icing to draw a smiley face on the chocolate button. This will form your pony's nose and his mouth. You will need two eyes and a smile. Now it's time to add your pony's eyes. We're going to take the edible eyes and stick them onto your pony using icing. Make sure you don't stick them too near to the pony's nose and mouth. Next we're going to give our ponies a bridle. To do this you will need to draw a line of icing straight across above his nose. You can use any colour for this. Then you want to put your pony aside and take another chocolate button. Carefully using your knife cut the chocolate button in half. You also want to take small slices out of both halves, a bit like a pizza. These pieces will form your pony's ears. Next you're going to stick the pony's ears on the top of his head above his eyes using icing. And there you have it. Your pony decoration is done. You can also make other pony designs. For this one I've used a bourbon so that my pony is dark and for this one I've made him into a unicorn using icing between his ears. Thank you for watching Shetland Pony Club TV. There's a new episode every Wednesday. You can subscribe to our channel or come on over and join us at shetlandponyclub.co.uk for lots of fun pony updates. Thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you next week for a new episode.